Queensland's biggest party is well and truly underway for thousands of school leavers who've hit surfers paradise for a second night of schoolies. Lauren Forbes is uh, right there for us on the Gold Coast this morning. So how are the celebrations going so far, Lauren? Well, Pete, some partygoers probably partied a little too hard last night and are yet to make it home sitting in parks and outside fast food restaurants feeling a little dusty this morning. But so far it's been nothing but praise from police for the class of 2023. Figures are yet to be released on the number of arrests made overnight, but police say not much happened. There were a few loud parties, uh, but far less than the normal amount. Now, thousands of party goers did pack the Beach Hub, which is located just behind me at Surfers Paradise Beach. And they were celebrating night two before spilling out onto the streets and into nightclubs last night. Yes, yes, yes. Yes. Go party! Go hard! Now, despite some very sore heads, many are pushing night two celebrations into this morning. Pretty oh, crazy. Heck day no. two. Day two. Four right, days yeah. to go. Everyone's. Haven't slept. Uh, yeah, we haven't slept. Everyone's getting crazy. Everyone's staying safe. Everyone's having fun. Yeah, great time. It's a bit cold. I'm just trying to walk around till I can get some Z's. Yeah, we need to indulge sleep. in the morning sunlight. Now thousands are gearing up for round three tonight and normally the tradition is for schoolies and party goers is to spend the day recovering at Surface Paradise Beach, uh, taking in that sunlight and t uh, having a dip in the water, trying to wash away that hangover. But unfortunately the forecast today is very cloudy, windy and a chance of showers. But there are no doubts, Pete, that this forecast will not dampen the spirits of the Class 2023. Thank you, Lauren.